Let's start by considering the Cartesian plane with axes OX and OY. Consider the point P with coordinates XY on the XY plane. Now consider the parallel axes O dash X dash and O dash Y dash. And let's assume that the point P has the coordinates x dash y dash with respect to these new axes. Therefore, the horizontal distance of point P from O dash y dash is x dash, and the vertical distance of the point P from the axis O dash x dash is y dash. We are also given that the coordinates of the point O dash with respect to the old axes are a minus c, b, and therefore the horizontal distance of the point O dash from O y is a minus c, and the vertical distance of the point O dash from O x is b. Finally, the horizontal distance of the point P from the axis O y is x, and the vertical distance of the point P from the axis O x is y. Looking at the horizontal distances, we note that x is equal to a minus c plus x dash and the distance y is equal to b plus y dash. Substituting these values of x and y in the given equation of the circle, x minus a whole square plus y minus b whole square is equal to c square, we get a minus c plus x dash minus a whole square plus b plus y dash minus b whole square is equal to c square. In the first term on the left hand side, a cancels and in the second term on the left hand side, b cancels and therefore this equation simplifies to x dash minus c whole square plus y dash square is equal to c square. This can be written as x dash square plus y dash square minus 2c x dash plus c square is equal to c square. c square cancels across the left hand side and the right hand side and therefore the required equation is x dash square plus y dash square minus 2cx dash is equal to 0.